La Mesquita de Cordoba is a stunning monument to the two religions and cultures that have shaped Andalusia, Islam and Christianity. A Renaissance church squats right on top of what was once the most important mosque in the Islamic Kingdom. The Great Mosque has two different areas, the courtyard where the minaret is constructed by Abd al-Rahman III and the Haram or Praying Hall. The interior space consists of a forest of columns, red and white arches, that give it a strong chromatic effect. The site is divided into five different areas, corresponding each one of them to the different expansions that have occurred on it. The site was originally home to a Roman temple, which was later replaced by a Christian Visigoth church. In 711, when the Moors took Andalusia from the Christians, the Visigoth structure was divided into two halves and used as a place of worship by both Muslims and Christians, a remarkable act of tolerance. But in 784, on the orders of the Emir Abd al-Rahman, the church was destroyed and work on a great mosque began. Construction lasted for over two centuries and the building was completed in 987. In the year 1236, Cordoba was recaptured by the Christians. Christian monarchs altered and added to the mosque, but they never demolished anything, resulting in the hybrid structure that remains today. You can see here the Renaissance nave, built by Charles V in the 16th century, right in the middle of the Mesquita. La Mesquita's unique design and special materials help in complementing the airy atmosphere created by the alternating arches of red and white in the massive prayer hall. This gives you an infinite forest-like feel. La Mesquita stands as an example of a blend in culture and architecture between the East and the West. La Mesquita is part of Cordoba's history and it is a living expression of the existence of different cultures that come together and form a vibrant and colorful ambience.
Guardate il suo nome lungo. Langostine. Vă rog cine ești, preferiți.